Nin explains the rules of racquetball. The object of the game is to score more points than your opponent. Racquetball, sometimes referred to as American racquetball, is played indoors on a court with these measurements. This is similar to the games of squash and British racquetball, but with a few significant differences. Players play with bigger racket heads and a bouncier ball on a longer and narrower court. The game starts with a player serving the ball. To serve, a player must be in the serving zone and bounce the ball onto the floor before hitting it. The ball must bounce behind the short line and travel over the receiving line. The opponent must wait behind the receiving line during a serve and cannot cross it until the ball has crossed the receiving line. You have to play the ball by hitting it onto the front wall. The ball may hit any of the walls and the ceiling, but you are only allowed to let the ball bounce on the floor once. If you let the ball bounce twice on the floor, you lose a point. The idea of this game is to make it difficult or impossible for your opponent to play a good shot back, or to force an error out of your opponent. This exchange is known as a rally. In racquetball, you can only score a point if you serve the ball. If the server wins the rally, they score one point and continues to serve. If the opposing player wins the rally, then no point is scored, but that player then takes over the serving. Once you play a shot, you have to try and get out of the way of the ball and your opponent. If you try to get out of the way but couldn't, this is known as a hinder or a replay hinder and the point is replayed again. If you obstruct your opponent to deny them a clear winning shot, your opponent will win the rally. This is known as a penalty hinder. The first player to score 15 points wins the game and racquetball is usually played to the best of three games. The last game is only played to 11 points. The person who wins two games the fastest wins. That's pretty much it, but there's a few other things that you'll need to know before playing or watching racquetball. For example, serve faults. There's a lot of things you cannot do when serving the ball. Without going into too much detail, here's a list of things you cannot do. Double fault. Similar to tennis, you are allowed two chances to serve the ball properly. If you make two serving faults in a row, you lose the serve and the serve goes to your opponent. Called hinder. If you believe that by making your next shot you risk injuring your opponent, you can call a hinder and the result is that you replay the point. In racquetball, safety is of paramount importance. Be sure to check out my Rules of Squash video which also covers the British version of racquetball. But if you have found this video at all helpful, please like, share and subscribe. It takes me ages to make one of these things and good karma is very much appreciated. Follow me on Twitter also, but in the meantime, enjoy racquetball.